be a better football team as the season goes along towards that game. Vince, you called it. You said that the Saints would beat the Rams. You said well, by, I thought you said by ten. You said by eight. By eight. That was pretty close. But, you know, it. that's, that's, a tough, that's a tough one. And but I knew that like was going to have their hands full. Yeah. I do. Yeah, I thought it was good. I got a shout-out to Robert White from Culver City, one of our religious viewers out there. Hi, Robert. And, Jackie, I know you got a shout-out to your team. Shout-out to the uh, – Zusa Pacific Cougs. You won they yesterday. Won. We got a game this nice weekend. Job, if we win that game, all hands got to be on deck. Everybody, on. trainers, everybody. We win that game, we're co-champions. Oh, Good. all right. That's it for this edition of Sports Wrap. I'll be back tonight with sports at 11 o'clock. Make sure you join me a whole half hour. Susan Harris and Phil Schumann next with the news. See you later. Now, this is the Fox 11 Weekend News. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Phil Schumann. And I'm Susan Hirosuna. Welcome to the Fox 11 Weekend News. We begin with breaking news out of Boyle Heights, where an out-of-control truck slammed right into a food stand, injuring four people. Leah Uko is live at Boyle Heights with the latest. Leah. As Susan Phil, this truck did a lot of damage, a lot of which is still here at the corner of Soto and Olympic. Take a look. I'm told the truck hit another car, the taco stand, and several people, all within a matter of seconds. A witness sent us this video of the aftermath. Take a look. The woman who recorded this video.